Auto Tour? Yep. I have to try it all. You have to try it all, girl. That's new. Ooh, that's new. I know. That's, this whole industry is made up, is like, couldn't exist at nearly the level that it does if people didn't have a bunch of products under their cabinet. Absolutely. Women do that. So the image studio sells this and not these sizes. Mm -hmm. But I have a cocktail of the two of these in your hair right now. I have protein and moisturizing product. I don't recommend that you get the protein one, okay? Because what's supposed to happen is that you don't need the protein. Mm -hmm. You understand? Your, yeah. your hair is the protein. Right. So if you get to the point where you're having to put protein in the hair, it's kind of already, you're already acknowledging that the hair is compromised. So we want to get your hair to the point where, you know, from me, you, me doing your hair a couple of the times, mm -hmm. we reinforce the protein structure of the hair some, which is just gluing the fingernail together. It's not fixing it. Mm -hmm. The only way to get that hair healthy is to do what? Moisturize. No. How, if you have a nail and it's got a, it's got a crack in it, what's the way to get oh, the nail healthy? You gotta cut that part off, right? Mm -hmm. So you grow it, cut it, grow it, cut it, grow it, cut it, until you have a real, full, healthy strand of hair, mm -hmm. okay? And when we get you to that point, then we can start doing some cool stuff with color. Mm -hmm. Because now we have a healthy head of hair to start working with, that we're working from. Um, so, but the moisturizing product, you can do every third or fourth shampoo. Okay. So you would put a mass, did you see how gooey it's full, I mean it's loaded, the 16 ounce jar of that would only probably last you four treatments. Mm -hmm. But a jar of it sells for, I don't know, 20 or $30, and that's what they charge for one treatment in, this, in the salon. Oh wow. Right? So that's one of the reasons, this is in the salon. This isn't a retail product, but we retail it, the image studios retails it to clients because you need it. And, it. and you can't break your hair with it. There's nothing that you can do wrong. It makes sense for you to be able to do it at home. And if I don't have, um, say I don't have a dryer to sit under, how long should I be leaving it in my hair? And you shouldn't use it because it's heat activated. Okay. The only thing, remember that's what I was saying about the heat. Yeah. This only works because the hair swells up with heat mm -hmm. and then the stuff fuses in there and they're low molecular weight, mm -hmm. you know, um, um, ingredients that allow it to fit in between the imbrications okay. and then it cools down and it now you've created this, this, this um, sealant on the outside of the hair shaft. So if I have a cap, like a cap that heats up, yeah, is that? Yeah, that's perfect. Okay. A heating cap, kind of like something like this. Yeah. Yeah, that's perfect. So the, the sitting with the product on the hair for a long time doesn't do anything. Doesn't do anything. A good conditioner is going to do what it's going to do, mm -hmm. anything worthy, within a minute. 60 seconds, that's it. Now with product technology, sitting for longer is not earning you, it doesn't earn the hair anything. It does feel softer, mm -hmm. but softer means stretchier, means weaker, mm -hmm. isn't good for the hair. And it eventually has to dry back out to the point where it's the right, it only softens that outside layer. Right. So it just kind of makes the nails wiggly, soft. Mm -hmm. But that's not good, you don't want that. You want that part firm, you just want the, you want it, you want them hard, Right? right? But you don't want them brittle. Right. So same thing with the hair. Okay. You don't want it soft and waterlogged.